the Quran Lee app. Subscription cheaper than Netflix, encouraging Quran reading, modern, engaging, and fun. Download it today. That's a gen, yeah. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome to another episode of Smile to Jannah. This week a viral video of a Muslim Indian hijabi has been going around where you can see that she is innocently going to college to hand in her assignment and then upon seeing an extremist Hindu mob protesting her wearing the hijab and trying to intimidate her she stands up to them like a lioness all to defend her right to dress in accordance to her faith. She's not violating any Indian laws or even the laws of the school. But since this has been going everywhere, all is taken is a simple student just going and handing her assignment in and subhanallah and she just refused to be intimidated and now we see her as a symbol of resistance. Now subhanallah, she didn't go over the top. Had she gone over the top or done something inappropriate? Of course, they would have used that to bang us over the head with as well. Had she done nothing, then she would have been like many others that are just trying to survive. Not everyone's in a position to be able to do this. So what was awesome is people have taken this heroic response and animated it. Yeah, there's so many cartoons, so many visuals, animations going around as you guys can see. There was another occasion where we saw it on the front page of a newspaper that I'm assuming it's in India. Now naturally you're not going to see this spoken much about in the western media because it's not like it's a woman's right issue. Oh wait it is. All right, may, it's not a human right. Wait it's that as well. It, why is it not spoken out then? Is it because it's a Muslim issue? Uh, yes, yes and yes and no, yes. <laughs> and what was even more amazing was somebody that's using his celebrity status to mashallah also amplify the voice of these simple hijabis. Paul Pogba who plays football for England's Manchester United. You can see he posted something on his Instagram page and subhanallah him just reposting that is it's no joke because two days ago Look what he posted. It's just a picture of him doing sajda of shukr. That's the prostration of gratitude. And if you look in the description, it says Alhamdulillah, which means all praise be to Allah. And look at the sorts of people that are following him. Yeah, you've got a response from Adidas, the brand. These individuals have a reach of their own. So for them to reach out like Emma Watson did, the Harry Potter, actress in uh, solidarity with Palestine and look at the discussion that caused. So although we're not supposed to be following celebrities but I don't think anybody can deny the influence and power they actually have. And also what was amazing was those of you that like reading about politics and history you're probably familiar with the name of Noam Chomsky. Even he raised out his voice in condemnation of what the extremist Hindus are doing in India. The pathology of Islamophobia is growing throughout the West. It's taking its most lethal form in India where the Modi government is systematically dismantling Indian secular democracy and turning the country into a Hindu ethnocracy with almost 250 million Muslims becoming a persecuted minority. So on the whole, although a lot of madness is going on in India, this is just like one occasion that you guys know of. Just today, I saw another video that's going around of hijabis just trying to walk and you've got these yobs, these uh, ruffians that are throwing dirty water on these hijabis. Wallahi, I'm going to be honest with you. When I saw that, you know, even if you're like a rational, calm person, that really does something to you. May Allah protect our sisters that are going through all of this. Allahu Akbar. This is supposed to be the world's biggest democracy but it's the world's biggest joke now because extremism has taken over and extremism in any form in any religion should be condemned and should be sidelined. Anyways guys let's leave it there until next time. Assalamu alaikum.